We're here at the John Lakes uh, Preserve and we just are dedicating this bird blind in recognition of Earth Month. Here in Orange County, we celebrate our sustainability and resiliency efforts countywide, and we are preserving additional environmentally sensitive lands. And so uh, we're out enjoying a bit of nature and wildlife here. We had to, the opportunity to look at uh, some rare bird species through the bird blind. Uh, there's a bald eagle uh, in uh, one of the treetops back here and then we saw some other rare birds as well. The first bird blind that Orange County has put on any of their Green Place properties. It's where someone would sit and wait to see the birds and you know you have angles that you can look with your binoculars and uh, also for photograph. Uh, it would be a great place for photography. Well we just saw boat tail grackles. I, earlier I saw a little um, yell, common yellow throat, a real pretty little bird. Um, you know, birding is seasonal, so any season you might see something slightly different. People can disagree about everything else, but the one thing that they agree on is the need for conservation lands, public spaces, public parks. I think we all understand that this is the, um, this is the space that keeps our air clean, keeps our water clean, uh, provides the biodiversity we need to survive, and that all, every other species needs to survive. Certainly we know that it's important to add to the water quality of the region. You know, when we have these open areas, it allows for percolation, it allows for water to be returned to the water table, and it's such a critical and vital resource for an environment and for a community, um, especially the open space as well. You know, it's a place that communities can come together, families can come, and spend time in the open air and enjoy recreation and enjoy the environment. We do have development that is happening all around us. And it's so nice to have a piece of property that is untouched by that development. It's an area where neighbors from around this conservation area can commune with nature, but also we can highlight that for our visitors to come and recreate here, come out and enjoy this property. When the water is low like it is now, you can really see a lot more. Um, bring your binoculars. Uh, we ask that you leave only footprints and take only pictures and, and enjoy it. This is your land. And I think it's important that people know that their tax dollars have gone into preservation this important, this beautiful. It's really important uh, to dedicate and preserve some green space because uh, God's not making any more land. And so we have to take the opportunity while we're growing county with significant development going on to not just uh, take all of our lands and pave over it, but we do have to preserve these green spaces for our children and our children's children so that they'll have a space to go to and enjoy Florida's natural wildlife and habitat.